न्यूक्लिक एसिड्स न्यूक्लिक एसिड्स आर वन ऑफ द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट बायोमोलिक्यूल्स व्हिच आर प्रेजेंट इन द लिविंग ऑर्गेनिजम्स एंड दे एक्ट एज रिपोजिटरीज फॉर द जेनेटिक इंफॉर्मेशन इन द लिविंग ऑर्गेनिजम्स ऑल दो न्यूक्लिक एसिड्स एंड देयर कंपोनेंट्स हैव अ नंबर ऑफ फंक्शंस टू परफॉर्म इन द सेल बट द मेन फंक्शन इज द स्टोरेज एंड transmission of genetic information in the living organisms and this storage and transmission of genetic information is one of the fundamentals of to sustain life like proteins and polysaccharides nucleic acids are also polymeric compounds as you know proteins are the polymers of amino acids amino acids are the building blocks of proteins similarly polysaccharides such as starch and cellulose they are made up of repeating units of glucose so glucose is the building block of polysaccharides like starch and cellulose similarly nucleotides are the repeating units in a nucleic acid so nucleic acids are the polymeric compounds which are made up of nucleotides nucleic acids are mainly of two types these are ribonucleic acids and deoxyribonucleic acids ribonucleic acid is abbreviated as rna while deoxyribonucleic acid is generally abbreviated as dna there are three types of rnas these are trna transfer rna ribosomal rna rrna and messenger rna mrna they have a number of functions to perform in the cell mainly during the protein synthesis while deoxyribonucleic acids dna they are only of one type there are no uh, other types of dna and they are uh, mainly present in the nucleus in addition to chloroplast and mitochondria as you know the protein sequence the sequence of amino acids in a protein molecule that depends on the nucleotide sequence in the dna molecule so dna molecule describes the amino acid sequence of a protein similarly the nucleotide sequence of a mrna these are dictated by the nucleotide sequence of dna so a segment of dna which is responsible for the synthesis or production of a functional product either mrna or a protein this segment of dna is called a gene so as you know there are thousands of gene in an organism so obviously the dna molecule contain thousands of genes so it will be it will be a long molecule 